competitiveness. One of the important things that we had to figure out how to do was in a world where most manufacturing has transitioned into economies with very low wages, uh, very little regulation, very little uh, taxation, and tariffs have been stripped away, is how are we going to provide these quality products that we want to make at a competitive price? And what we found out was we can't go through traditional retail. And what I mean by that is if you go to the store and you buy something for $100, a lot of people don't know this, but the store is making about a 70% profit on that, which means they're taking 70 out of the $100 that you purchased for themselves. And then of the $30 that's left over, the brand that really doesn't make it anymore, they're buying it from somewhere else, but they put their brand on there, they take about half of that $30. So that only leaves $15 out of your $100 purchase to produce the product, ship it all the way over here, and all of that. So what we developed, and a lot of companies have done this, is a business-to-customer model, where we sell directly to you over the web. So we can afford to sell our products for that $100, even though it costs us a lot more than $10 or $15 to make them. 